Hey, what's up everyone? Mystic Mike here with iMixer, uh, doing a short little tutorial video on how to actually download the fireworks skills event and action group into Mix It Up Bot. So what we're going to do today, it's very, very simple. I've, I'm actually going to start from scratch uh, with the iMixer account. Um, basically, the first thing you want to do, uh, such as what was done in the uh, previous video by Kel, which you'll find at the end of this, we'll have it linked at the end. You're going to want to have a uh, currency name Sparks used or Sparks, or you can call it really whatever you want. For this video here, I'm just going to call it Sparks used. Uh, I'm going to get rid of these ones because in reality, we don't really need these because the only way we're giving Sparks is through the events. Uh, so the first thing we're going to show you is you need the action group fireworks. Now, unfortunately, at the moment, you cannot download the action groups. They are, it is on their backlog to do. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to download it as a command first. So you're going to go to download from store. I'm going to show you the action group first because you need the action group in order for the event to work. So you're going to type in fireworks. If I could spell correctly, fireworks. There we go. So you got here, this is the channel one you're going to use. This is the actual one, the, the action group you're going to need. So as I said, you're going to download it first. Now this, this command contains included assets. Would you like to download? And that's going to be the fireworks images. Now you can change the images to whatever you want at the end of the day. That is your choice. Uh, for myself, I kind of like, I went through a bunch of different fireworks one and that was the best one I found, um, I'm just going to put it in images, I guess, for now. Boom, there we go. So here's what it is. This is it. The overlay, it's fireworks GIF. Again, you're going to save it wherever you want. This is just where I put mine. Uh, the way each overlay works is the fireworks go off uh, for both. They stay up for two seconds in a random spot, but there's a one second delay between each one as they go up. Now the first thing, save it. Uh, if you want, actually, we're not even going to save it. Here's what we're going to do. You're going to want to export this to a file. Okay, we're going to, because we do have to name it. So we're going to call it Fireworks and Fireworks. And of course, I spelled Furworks, but we'll fix that. That's a simple fix. Now we're going to export it. Uh, you can save it anywhere you want, really. Uh, I'll just save it for now uh, right here. Fireworks.mixitup C. Save it there. Uh, now, ideally, you can just close out of this if you want. You don't really need to save that. So I'm going to just delete it because I don't want it as a command. I want it as an action group. So we're going to go action groups, new action group. Now, what you're going to want to do is go to import action from file. You're going to pick that one. It'll take a couple seconds. Boom. There we go. Now it's here. Now I'm going to call it fireworks. We're going to save it. There we go. That is our action group. We'll come back to that in a sec. Next, you're going to go to your events. You're going to go to skill used. Again, we're going to download it right from the store because this has already been made. Everything, all the hard work has already been done for you. Now you just got to download it and use it. So now we're going to search fireworks again. This is the one we want. Skill used. Download. Here it is. So now we're going to go through here. The chat is going to say, you know, username used sticker fireworks or skill fireworks or whatever it's going to be here uh, we're going to say add to sparks use add to user whatever the skill cost uh, the overlay this is going to show where the, the stickers you can change this as well and uh, modify to your liking for me i like it that usually i have my camera on the other side of the screen over there so i like to have the stickers kind of come up right above my head so when it's like a pumpkin pie i can pretend to eat it or a pizza you know a little more interaction with the stickers and whatnot um again you can change all that uh, i find 340 by 340 worked best for myself but again play with it the, everyone's computer is going to be different everyone's overlays etc etc so you're going to want to play with this to make it best for you i have mine set for 10 seconds and then i have um at the bottom a wait of 11 seconds that way as a sticker comes up that sticker stays up for 10 seconds goes away one second boom the next one comes up when you're doing like say a sticker party or skill party now next this is the important part for getting the fireworks images to show up you go here you want these two conditionals they're already done all you're going to do is go in here say action group fireworks action group fireworks and that's it basically 
what this is doing is saying when the skill name equals fireworks show, which is the one that goes off in the uh, the chat, like multiple ones, or skill name equals firework, which is the one that just is just the one pew, puny one that comes up. Then it's going to trigger that action group and both of those are going to go off. So we're going to save that. And ideally what that's going to look like when someone uses the skill fireworks, this is what's going to happen. So I'm going to hit play and we'll see if this works. Oh, you know what I did not do? I don't have a mix it up in this one. So give me one sec, guys. I'm going to switch over to this screen for a sec. I'm going to copy this. And then we're going to go back to this. And we're going to paste a reference to it. And I'm going to bring it to there. Now it should work. There. So now when any, anytime anyone uses the skill fireworks, firework or fireworks show, this is what's going to pop up. It's just going to go boom, boom, boom like that. And what I'll do is I will even bring up, I will go to the mixer channel here. Mix it up. The Mix I Mixer channel, which if you guys aren't following, definitely drop a follow. We do a regular game night every second Saturday of the month. So I'm going to go here. We're going to see if this works. I might need to be, uh, I am logged into it. So we're going to set off, we'll say firework. Pew. Yep, there we go, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages. You now have fireworks. Again, if you have any questions whatsoever about this, feel free to join our Discord. Uh, as well, follow us on iMixer here, mixer.com slash iMixer, as well as on Twitter, at iMixer underscore. Again, guys, I hope this video was very informative. I hope it helped you a lot. If you do have any further questions whatsoever about how to get this up and running, do not hesitate to leave a comment in the bottom. Do not hesitate to contact either myself or Kel. Um... And that is it, yeah. Feel free, guys, to leave comments below. Let's try for five likes, five comments, and see if we can't get 10 subscribers out of this. Thank you very much, guys, again, and you have yourself a great day. This is Mystic Mike from iMixer. Enjoy.